Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today's topic is about the triangle and its properties. A triangle is a three-sided figure formed by joining three line segments together at their endpoints. As you can see in this figure, a triangle has three sides, three vertices, and three angles. There are three types of triangles based on sides. Scalene triangle, isosceles triangle, and equilateral triangle. Scalene triangle. Scalene triangle has no equal sides. You can see in this figure, all the three sides of this triangle have different lengths. So it is called a scalene triangle. Isosceles triangle Isosceles triangle has two equal sides. You can see in this figure, in triangle ABC, two sides AB and BC are of equal length. So it is a isosceles triangle. Equilateral triangle Equilateral triangle has all three equal sides. You can see in this figure, in triangle ABC, all three sides are of equal length. So it is called a equilateral triangle. Now we will learn about Types of triangles Based on angles There are three types of triangles Based on angles Acute triangle Right triangle And obtuse triangle Acute triangle In acute triangle All three angles are less than 90 degrees In this figure all the angles are less than 90 degree. So it is called an acute triangle. Right triangle. Right triangle has one right angle. In this figure, one of the angle of this triangle is of 90 degree. So it is called a right triangle. Obtuse triangle. Obtuse triangle has one angle greater than 90 degree. In this figure, in triangle ABC, measure of angle A is of 110 degree, which is greater than 90 degree. So it is called an obtuse triangle. Triangle Sum Theorem The sum of the three angles of a triangle is 180 degree. Let's see some examples. Triangle Inequality Theorem The sum of the lengths of any two sides of a triangle is greater than the length of the third side. In this figure we can see that in this triangle A plus B greater than C, A plus C greater than B, and B plus C greater than A. From this example, we can say that, in a triangle, if we take sum of any two side, it is always greater than third side. Medians of a triangle A median of a triangle is a segment whose endpoints are a vertex of the triangle and the midpoint of the opposite side. For instance, in this triangle ABC, D is the midpoint of side BC. So, AD is a median of the triangle. In any triangle there are exactly three medians. Centroid of a triangle the centroid of a triangle is the point of concurrency of the three medians. The centroid divides each median into a piece one-third the length of the median and two-thirds the length. Centroid theorem. The centroid is two-thirds of the distance from each vertex to the midpoint of the opposite side. For example, AG is two-thirds of AF. Each median is split into two parts, such that the longer part is twice the length of the shorter part. For example, CG equals twice DG. Altitude of a triangle. The altitude of a triangle is a line segment from a vertex that is perpendicular to the opposite side. 
Altitude of an acute triangle Altitude of a right triangle Altitude of an obtuse triangle Properties of altitude of a triangle A triangle has three altitudes. The three altitudes meet at a point, called the orthocenter of the triangle. Makes the shortest distance, from the vertex, to its opposite side. In an acute triangle, the orthocenter lies within the triangle. In a right triangle, the orthocenter coincides with the vertex of the right angle. In an obtuse triangle, the orthocenter lies outside the triangle. Thank you for watching my video. If you like this video please like and share. And subscribe my channel for more videos.